Hey guys, Bananiac here. So today I'm going to be reviewing Nalini's Black Label Cycling Kit. I've reviewed their Blue Label before, but I really wanted to see how it compared to what the pros are wearing. First up, we have the Astana Cycling Kit, and I'm sure you guys have seen these before if you watch any pro cycling on television. This is the exact same kit that Vincenzo Nibali wears, except that he has the Italian flag across his chest because he is the Italian national champion. Nalini actually sponsors Astana, as well as many other pro cycling teams such as Kofidis and Gazprom Colnago. I really like this kit, despite of it looking super tight, it's actually really comfortable and breathable, and the chamois on it is really thick for just everyday riding. Nalini also has a line called April Light, which is their super aero, super tight kit. They have a jersey and a bib set, as well as a full-on skin suit. In my opinion, I think the jersey and bib set is much more practical. You have the short sleeve as opposed to the long sleeve and way more mesh on the jersey. The skin suit can get pretty hot if you're doing a lot of miles in the summertime, so probably best something to save for time trials or races. Although I will say that this skin suit is way more practical than some of the other skin suits out there on the market. They still have the full three pockets in the back and you can fully unzip the top half of the skin suit in case it does get hot out. Nalini also makes some really nice gloves. These particular ones don't have a Velcro strap. They're slip-on, which is something that I really prefer because you don't have to keep messing with it to find, I guess, the correct fit. Uh, you just slip right into it. The padding on these are not super thick. They're definitely on the minimal side but still very comfortable if you got some good handlebar tape. What I really like about these gloves is they did not use any leather to make them. And in my opinion, I think that that's a more sustainable and ethical approach to use synthetic material over leather. Many high-end gloves just come in leather, so it's awesome to see Nalini using synthetic over leather, and they just feel really great as well. Nalini also has some compression socks, which are very well made, and they do their job in terms of staying compressed, but in my opinion, I just thought they were a little too thick for the summertime. It could be just me, but I just prefer my socks to be super thin. But overall, I really like Nalini's Black Label Cycling Kit. They do fit a bit more snug than the Blue Label, but they're still very comfortable, very breathable, and just a very nice material that they use on these cycling kits. In terms of price, Nalini's stuff is towards the higher end, but you get what you pay for, especially with the padding on these bibs. You want to stay comfortable pretty much the whole time you're on the bike. And I've gone through a lot of kits throughout the years, and I definitely say that Nalini makes some of the best. So I hope you guys enjoyed this review. Give it a thumbs up if you did. And I want to thank Alba Beachy for sending me all this awesome stuff to review. They are the US distributors of Nalini products as well as other Italian cycling products. And I'll have the link to their website in the description down below, which you guys can check out if you're interested in any of these kits. Also, be sure to subscribe for more videos on cycling and other product reviews. Thank you guys for watching. We'll see you in the next video.